Welcome to Jumper Man Tech. And today, we're changing your sewer pump. So to get this cap off, this one right here, we gotta break apart this union. Here's the control panel. Right, yeah, Human time capsule. about fucking 10 inches high. <laughs> Two bolts. We have a long extension for the socket. It's the longest one. Alright, you start lifting, I'll guide you. Oh, this wire is going to be too short. Give me the snips. Alright, so kind of the power for the pump. Disconnected the two bolts, the flange, and this thing's ready to come out. Okay. I'll guide you. Start lifting. Good idea. <laughs> Gasket, okay, this cover, and two bolts. All right, let's get this new pump in there. Try to put the flange facing this way. Yep. Okay, let's go. Hold up, this has to go in this way, okay. and then has to be slit afterwards. Okay, bring it down. You got it. That's the new gasket. I said that's the gasket. Okay. You see this thing is way down. Off the floor, that's that's the one, one bolt. I'm gonna try and lift up with the rope a little bit. You ready? Okay. Right, so now we're just tightening down those two bolts. Um, Alright, that's the new pump. Let's put it right here. Time to wire it up. Basically, all it did was take off two bolts that were right here with the gasket, like I showed otherwise, and the other one. And that's about it. Very simple to change. Just cut these wires from the top, free it up, free out the outlet. This thing's ready to pull out, very simple. And now we're just gonna wire our connections for the pump, for the new one, into our contactor here. Well, this will be a motor starter, but you get the idea. This is a three-phase pump, and I will need to drill this new cord into the panel. So I'm just gonna take a step down bit and run it across. That's a perfect fit right there. Straight 
strap this down, roll this up, strap this down to the one that's already there, and connect our wires. Alright, so this is the left contactor, motor starter, white, red, black. We're gonna go with the same color, hopefully we have the same phases. Then our ground, we're gonna go to ground. So I'm gonna start by disconnecting. Black. Just go wire for wire. Nice to see you, Chuck. wrap these off to the side, cut off the ends, not being used anymore. Here's our three wires, hopefully we're going the right way, this is three phase. Just kind of straighten that out a bit. Got to close up this, we actually just tilted it to the side and worked around it. Got to tighten down this union, this valve is open, and uh, let's test the pumps. So our power is back on, so let's see. This is our, this is one of the pumps that's already in there. Bypass this. This is the pump that's in there. I just want to see how many amps it runs on. 3.2 amps. 3.4, 3.3, all right. Now I just want to test the amps on the pump I just changed. I'll manually start that, just flick it. Here it sounds good. Got about three amps, so I'd say that's okay. Right now, let's look at the water level and let's see how far this thing comes down. It seems to be pumping. This got tightened down, it's got no leaks. like it's slowly coming down at the same time there's water filling this up right down there but I can definitely see more of the pump levels definitely been brought down so keep an eye on it Let's see where this thing comes down to and it should be good you really do want to make sure is that you get the rotation correct you want to get the phases right on this pump but uh, that's about it we're pulling amps you can hear it running and that should be the deal right there we're in automatic operation you can see the light is on pump is pulling you can see that the pumps are actually submerged you look down here, those are the floats. I want to see if it works automatically off the floats. There's three floats down there. And we're running. So basically, just got to close this up. Put on this little piece right here to hold this down, pipe down. And we're out of here. That's how you change the pump. It's pretty simple. Just pretty disgusting. If anybody found this video interesting or helpful, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Catch you guys next time.
Welcome to Jumper Man Tech. And today, we're changing your sewer pump. 